Hello Virgos, this is your reading for September. Um, I have an announcement to make. I'm doing personal readings now, so if you're interested, I left all the information in the description of the video down below or even on the description of my channel. So, now let's get on with the reading. May whoever needs to hear something, <clears throat> if the card shows some meaningful insights. So, let's see what we have for Virgos, September. The main card, we have Blossoming, the Queen of Pentacles. Mm. Your card, Six of Staff, the Success. Um, coming from the outside, we have Possibilities, Two of Staff. Okay, here it goes. What you need to do? Five of staff. Wow, well, a lot of staffs in here. Totality. Uh, and the last one, patience. Seven of staff. Of um, pentacles. So, uh, for some of you Virgos. I think it has to do with learning how to be more accepting in a way or okay so your card the six of staff the success you've achieved something you've acquired something you finally Maybe got something that you wanted. You're on top of the world. <laughs> Somehow you're in a good place. You have some sort of achievement. You gain something or that you wanted or <clears throat> something like that. From the outside, I see this two of staff. Is this is like you have a choice? There, there are multiple multiple choices for you from now on there's like um someone is trying to present you maybe with another offer maybe you've like achieved something and then someone from the outside is is trying to give you another offer and um puts you in this place of tension something like this it's like you have something but then something from the outside is coming with new some something new another way to do things another way to uh, to go and this creates tension with this totality card there's a lot of tension trying to be on top of things. Maybe even competition at some point. Tension, competition, this sort of energy where you're trying to be on top of the game. <laughs> um, but this is about your growth with this blossoming, this Queen of Pentacles. Um, The cards are telling you to be patient. Don't rush into making decisions. Seven of Pentacles. Don't rush. Wait. Wait. Maybe things will be more clear later. Um, maybe you, you'll see things from a, another perspective. So don't rush to make decisions 
don't rush into things, don't rush maybe to even make judgments or just wait and be careful with this um, tension right now. Um, don't give in to the, the tension, don't give in to this it's like don't be so competitive, don't be so um, quick to get something, to gain something or to go in a certain direction. Uh, learn how to be more patient and with this Queen of Pentacles here blossoming, I'm not sure this may have to do with you learning how to to uh, be more in that energy of not really expecting much from others, but more of give from yourself. Um, be m more into their flowing, easy flowing energy where you're don't really have, as I said, expectations. You rely on yourself and on your what you have, on your your qualities, and let that shine through. And it will all be more clear later. Focus on what you focus on your positive qualities. Um, focus on yourself, on your strength, and don't try to give in to this uh, energy of trying to compete with others or trying to gain things in a certain way. Always feel like you have to fight something or someone. You need to kind of tone it down learn how to be more patient more and focus on your positive qualities um, and you will gain more in the long run because this achievement that you have it, it's a it's a short short term one it's yeah it's a success you have but it's at this moment right now you're on top of the world but later if you want to grow even further in a in this positive energy you really do have to rely on your inner qualities and uh, <clears throat> in the long term that is what will matter what what you built that you have in yourself and that you don't really have to rely on others and also you don't have to expect things from others where you can just let it flow from you so focus more be patient don't rush into things don't <clears throat> maybe it's not even about rushing to things like don't jump to conclusions don't think that this is how it is this is like you need to grow this is a short-term thing. Um, you need something that will last and it will only grow in a positive way if you focus on your qualities and develop your positive inner qualities that will make things last, that will turn things for the better or in the future or will keep things in a positive side in the future so don't um, <clears throat> go for fast earnings or for fast <clears throat> maybe whatever is being presented to you is like they're offering you something that you you gain something quick but you're not thinking about it long term so you need to sit on it you need to think on it and you need to focus on the what's coming in the long term, what you need for this success to be in the long term. Whatever is it that you've achieved or that you have, think of it like how much, how 
long will it last? How long can you rely on that? Focus on what will last in the future. <clears throat> and don't yeah, don't rush into taking decisions. You need to sit on it and think of think of things long term. Somehow that's what I got from this. For you guys. Um okay, let me draw one more card. I just want to make sure. But yeah. Uh, the magician the existence like everything it's possible there's a lot of potential for, for the future it's all like it's like you have the qualities you have what it need what you need inside you have it in you it's not something that you have to depend from something from the outside you already have potential and qualities focus on that and use what you have to do something positive because with even if you have qualities you may misuse them and this magician card is about how you're going to use what you have what you're what are you going to create with what you have will you, it's how you use the tools it's up to you you have the tools but now it will be up to you if you're going to go in a positive direction uh, you can use the same tools to go in a negative direction or do something that is not so positive. So think on it. Don't rush into things. Don't be glad you have some momentary success at the moment. Sit on it and think of it long term. So it's up to you. It's more, I feel like you need more reflection on um, what you can do that you can rely on yourself and develop uh, your, as I said, de develop your positive qualities and rely on your positive qualities and shift your focus from the, for the long term rather than for fast gains or you know something that may be momentary momentarily so yeah this is what I see for you guys I hope this made sense if you resonated with this and if you didn't then it's okay it's normal it's impossible for everyone to resonate with one reading so, so maybe in a future video I'll have a message for you or maybe you want a private reading whatever it is that you want so thank you for watching and I'll see you guys later. Bye bye.